Returning now to breaking news in Sampson County, where an intersection is closed after an 18-wheeler exploded. And it's quite a scene here. WRO's Matt Tallhelm just arrived on that scene in the last few minutes. Matt, what have you been able to find out about that situation? Yeah, well, just within the last few minutes here, they've actually brought in a record to start cleaning this up and removing what happened here. But as I step out of the way, I want to show you, you can see right here the burned, charred ca trailer here from this truck. You can see some of the firefighters looking at it right now. I'm told by uh, the lieutenant here with the Spivey's Corner Fire Department that the driver got out of his, the cab of the car, uh, the truck here, and went back to the back here where you can see those tires in that area. There was some sort of, of fire in that that area, he was trying to put it out using a fire extinguisher when it exploded. There was an explosion. According to uh, one of the witnesses that it works at a little tire shop right off to the corner here, they heard that. They first thought it was just a tire pop, but then it was this louder explosion right after that. Firefighters were quickly able to get here because the lieutenant that is on the scene here lives right around the corner from here. He quickly got here, helped put out the flames here. We are told the driver of this truck, though, was injured and has been taken to the hospital for his injuries and burns from that fire and explosion. But again, you can see that they're starting to work to clean this up and remove it. There are two wreckers that I see here right now. I want to show you, though, some of the impacts. This is Fayetteville Highway here. They're starting to actually reverse the tractor trailers and the cars that have been sitting in this line of traffic because it is taking so long to clear this up. This all started right around 1040 uh, this after this morning. So this has been a while. They've been sitting here. They're starting to back those up and remove them so that they can get back on the road. But you can expect that this road, Fayetteville Highway at Dunn Road, will be closed quite some time while they clean up this mess. Quite a scene there. Matt Tallhelm live for us this noon. Sampson County. Matt, thanks.